All right, we are finally back. I was going to do an intro, but I just remember I already did my intro. Kind of, I did my intro, kind of. Basically, we are back. Uh, the team overall didn't change. You see, still 79 offense, 81 defense, 79 overall team. But we are a kind of a totally different team right now. We did do some trades. Uh, I'm just show you a quick glance of the team. It doesn't look too crazy, but we did change. We got... Uh, Something Gardner, forgot his name. <laughs> Pat Gardner. I want to say Pat Gardner, but I'm like, that sounds like too much of a real name. But yeah, we got Pat Gardner. Uh, obviously traded for Miles Franklin, the number one overall pick. Looks great. I should show the stats, right? Looks really good. Like, looks so ready to just be a stud in this league, bro. Like, he just looks amazing. I'm looking for awareness. I just don't see it. Like, <laughs> I don't know where awareness is, bro. I don't. Pat Gardner also looks like a fucking monster. Like, these receivers, like, we upgraded our, like, height and receivers. Like, all the receivers are, like, six feet and taller. So, that's great. But the the biggest guy here is Chris Gilchrist. 6'5", 235. Could jump out the fucking gym. He is amazing. 6'5"? He should be getting every jump ball, but you know he's not because that's how the game is. And now looking on defense, you do see a couple red and yellows. We did trade for some people. You saw we traded for uh, Justin Avery. That is his name. He is a absolute stud. We traded a second round and two-thirds for him. And we also got Dobbins. I think we got him in free agency, though. We got someone else. We got, like, one of these guys. I can pull up the trade thing. I think. Transactions, right? Wow, it's only going to show that stuff. Wow, that's actually pretty... Uh, that's bad. All right. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, that was... I guess that was in preseason. But, I mean, you see who's on the team. We just traded, like, some people weren't using... Trade for a couple picks. We have actually no picks left. We have like one second round left. And that's about it. Get two combined sacks or tackles for loss with Marquise Belton. Against the Jaguars to continue his breakout. Pretty easy. Pretty straightforward too. We can get that. We are facing the uh, the Cowboys. Didn't we face them week one last year? Is this a repeat of the schedule? <laughs> Do we just have the same schedule? Key to victory. I'm not going to lie. It has to be a stifling defense. I think our defense is good. I think, I think our offense is good, but we still have the same quarterback. So, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, disrupting the pass. He's going to tell me, like, hold him to, like, less than 200 passing yards. Y'all could have did 275 at least, bro. Y'all could at least, like, Slowed it down to 275. I'm not gonna lie. Set season goals. We won six games last year. So do we up it to seven or say playoffs? I'm gonna say seven. Cowboys have a superstar, um, I must say corner, quarterback. 80 overall. He's not the best. Pretty slow. Throw powers, the accuracy is kind of there. He's okay. Halfback, uh, not the greatest. They have some superstar receivers, Christopher Wall, James Yarbrough. I mean, pretty good. I mean, they're pretty speedy, too, especially the top two. Um, damn, they got a 6 wide receiver in Glenn Williams. That's crazy. Tight ends are pretty... Underwhelming, I would say. Our tackle's good. Good. Pretty decent offensive line. Not the greatest. Left end, good. Right end, good. <laughs> DT's good. NFL. Interesting group of corners. Interesting. Um, I think their defense is very spectacular. As it is rated at 84. 
overall defense. So we know that uh, we want we want to stop them from passing the ball. So we're gonna should we say defend deep pass? Let's say defend. No, they tell us to defend deep pass. Interesting. I'm gonna stick with defend short. I think that's a good idea. And for us, I think they keep saying throwing it deep. I'm gonna say also throw it short. Let's go off what worked last year. Throwing it short was really good for us. And also, I think we were undefeated in preseason, so that's, once again, wonderful. Throw two TD passes. Think we could do that. Uh, sack the quarterback three times. Let's try it. Pass for 275. Let's try it. And 15 first downs. Let's see if we could do it this season, fellas. Get Marv West in a scheme fit, please. He's a scheme fit now. He's also 73 overall. Throw under pressure three and throw accuracy short. He's not looking horrible. And something I wanted to do, I wanted to rework his throwing arm. That's a storyline I wanted to uh, bring into the season. So I think we're going to do that now. Let's go generic three. Thaddeus Benz, who did have a good season last year. Where he uh, he was playing backup, but in his backup role, he was coming in and pretty much getting a lot of sacks, which is obviously is not unheard of, but it's like, that's what you like to see out of your backup. Like, when it's your time to come in and play, make it count. Julius Jackman didn't see the field a lot. It was mainly a, once again, backup. But when he did see the field, he was pretty decent. Not the best, but for what he offered, he did play well. I will admit that. Is this prime time? Probably not. Sun is still out. Wes did rework his throwing arm in the offseason. Him and a coach and a GM didn't see anybody they liked in free agency, really. Could have picked up somebody in free agency, but they didn't really want to do that. They also just didn't see anybody in the draft that was really worth a top pick or even a pick at all. So they did stick with Wes, and when they did make that decision, they did decide to rework his throwing arm, put in the work in the offseason, change his throwing motion, and, you know, we're going to see how beneficial changing his throwing motion was. Was it his throwing motion that caused all those interceptions or caused him to play that bad? Or just was it his play style that caused him to play that bad? Or just was it him? Is he just not that good of a quarterback? I mean, all these things are um, going to be answered in this season. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We're being like a big deal. Everything is covered. And almost intoed. Are they going to say we intoed that? They're going to say we intoed that. Wow. I'm going to say no rollouts. Get there. Good job, Franklin. First catch of the season. Saw it very crowded in that area. Was a little scared to throw it. There we go, Franklin. Should be a first down. Both third down uh, receptions have been to Franklin. So is he is he my third down guy? There we go. Getting the first down is going to be first and goal now. This is where we kind of got to punch it in, fellas. I think it's going to be a blitz. It is a blitz. I didn't see him there. I did not see him there. I swear I didn't. Wow, I really did not see him there. That's a fucking... Wow, I really didn't. I did not... I could not see him there now. Let's go. Pressure got in. That's what I'm talking about. And a newly assigned Justin Avery coming in on a sack. He was fast, bro. Yeah, he got really attacked from both edges. I like that.
There we go, fellas. Let's go. Tackle for loss, third and 20. Let's sit in coverage. Let's not blow it, though. Yes, yeah, overthrow. Thank you. Because he kind of beat me right there. Didn't think it was going to be that sort of route. Beautiful. Get there. Franklin again. Looking very good. See, I think I need to change. Gibson is in as my primary tight end. And that is not the way we had it last year. Not that I don't like that, but I kind of like uh, Hudges in a little bit more. Get there. Another catch. I was a little scared to throw. I'm like, ah, do we want to do that? We ended up doing it. I mean, it worked out, but it was a little risky to do it. I don't have nobody, bro. Overthrown. We'll take a field goal here. It just was not looking the best right there. Might have missed this. Yep. That kick was... I don't know. That was a bad kick. <laughs> I just let it... Uh, slide a little bit too much, I guess. There's no way I'm not. I'm spamming A. What the hell? I'm following it, bro. I am. But I'm too underneath. Like, I'm way underneath it. How is he catching that? Can I see that, bro? He's throwing it right at me. He threw it at me, like, twice now. Like, it's disrespectful at this point. Look at me. I see it. I'm breaking on the ball right now. It's not even a good attempt for him. Because as soon as he throw it right here, I'm going for the pick. He's throwing at me. I'm, I'm a second late on it. I'm a second late. Because you know what I don't want to happen? I don't want him to be running around and then him just sit down and he gets it. That's what I'm trying to prevent. Big hit. I thought you fumbled for a second. Let's try man coverage. We have better corners so we can play man now. Oh my god, bro. I slowed down a little bit because I, I was it was gonna be PI, or at least I felt. Good tackle. Good tackle again. Let's get there, fellas. Third down now. All right, good stop. I think that's a legit fumble, too. We could obviously see a replay. I think that's a legit fumble. Yeah, overturn. They're going to take a field goal here. 
That was a very close one, though. I'm not going to lie. All right, we got to get points on this drive. We made it downfield twice and obviously threw it in, so then missed a the field goal. Come on. I'll just say it, bro. There we go. There's my boy. I think that was Gardner right there. Yo, oh my god. Whoever that is is fucking dominating me. There we go. That ball was ugly thrown. I did not like that. Let's call timeout. Cause the ball should have just been thrown one stride, easy. Please don't get beat by this man. Ah, I'm gonna let clock run a little bit. It's gonna be second down. There's no way I didn't get it. What's the call? Hold. There we go. Huges. Really good throw. Seen that middle linebacker not come back and that safety stayed to the right. Beautiful thrown ball. He could have jumped that, honestly, but he didn't. Get fucked. Oh, my God. I hate this fucking... DT or whatever he is. He disrupts everything, man. There we go. Good yards for Gibb. We got full momentum right now. No, oh, I want to put you on a flat. Yeah, do that. This might be a bad play, bro. Kind of is. I had one route going to completely left where I'm play action to. I had a flat on the right. I had another, like a post going to the right. It's like, bro, that play was not going to work out. At least the way I wanted it to, it wasn't. See, I don't even like doing this under center. I like running this play, but it's not under center, I don't. Yo, there's no room for anything right now. The main look is Gib. And Gib is not open. Another missed throw. I'm going to try to kick a field goal here, a 43 yarder. Should be able to. We kind of got the wind. Not really on our side, but in a way it's on our side. I missed again. Oh, no, I actually got it. Thanks to the wind, actually. I actually got that because of the wind. How did he get burned? I don't get it. You have to be kidding me, bro. Rivers. I don't know who Rivers is. Wow. All right. All right, we're punting. No, we're, yes, we are. I'm like, oh, no, it's only third. Nope, we're punting. Good sack. That's Belton right there. And uh, one of my outside linebackers are injured. He has a dislocated elbow. Bring somebody in. I'll let you know right now, you're not stopping shit with that dislocated elbow. Oh, good breakup right there. I like that. I'm just praying, don't get mossed, don't get mossed.
Good tackle. Get him off the field. That's how you do it when you really don't have a good offensive drive. Come out and play fantastic defense just like that. That's beautiful. Come on. I think that's a good catch. Uh, why did he move from his spot? Why did he move? Like, just sit down right there. That's annoying as fuck, man. Good tackle again. Belton having himself a good-ass week. He has a couple tackles for loss and two sacks right now. And you know who's to thank for that? The coverage. Another good tackle. Don't know who that was. Probably one of my corners, right? I hate this game. Hello? He went down. He didn't get anything but bro. What an effort play and almost a cheating play, honestly. There we go. Another catch for Gardner, I think. Carter, whatever his name is. He's probably the one with the most catches right now. The middle is so open on this. Please block the edge. Because he's going to be the one to come over. All right. Probably most yards we got today on a singular run. Beautiful blocks running here. First down. Run the ball here. Put true clock on. Get this down to the three. There we go. It's not a first and goal just yet. I'm gonna run again. I see the meanie. Oh, he actually didn't get me. He was pursued a little bit. I'm running again because I just want to waste clock at this point. And we get it right here. Uh, we want to play. It's going to be down to under 230. Thank you for stopping me. I needed that. I needed that stop. And then obviously we just call a play here. We're not going to run anything. But we call a play here. It's going to be down to a two-minute warning. Might try to just run it twice. Maybe. And it just looks very open. Like, see, right there, I would prefer y'all to stop us, but y'all just didn't. And now y'all got no two-minute warning. Obviously, you have all your time out, so... Going downfield wouldn't be the hardest thing in the world, but then again, you guys have struggled to get downfield on us at a consistent rate. Thank you for not getting blocked. Two minute warning. No, it's a penalty. Holding. We're gonna bring that back, right? Make it a first and 20. Does the clock not stop running? I mean, it should still be running, right? It doesn't stop on offensive plays. Under the two minute warning. You can let them get that, they're gonna hurry up. Hello? What the fuck? I was calling the play, they didn't let me call it. I'm 
I'm gonna run hard flats one play. I ran the wrong thing. Good, they stay in bounds though. Calling timeout. Smart. Where's my cover threes? Where are my cover threes? Where my there, there. I'm gonna run cover three hard flat, see what it does. I know what routes I'm gonna have to cover. Well at least areas. He still caught that. Oh my god, and he got out of bounds too. Wow, he didn't. There we go. Oh my god. They need to call timeout again. Let's go. Got 31 seconds, a second of 18. Uh, he was throwing that downfield. I think he possibly could have got that there, too. Oh, my God. It's, it's lucky. No skill in that. It's lucky. It's literally so lucky, bro. Like, how is this happening? We might have just lost the game again in a in a in a fashion where it happened against the Bears. Should they be able to hit this field goal, though? I don't think so. It's actually ice, too. Nope. Nope. Thank you. That's one of the first times ever in my life I've seen them miss a kick like that. All right, we got overtime. Win the tip, win the tip. We're going tails. Oh, we're not going to anything, actually. They got the ball. All right. Bro, we stopped them before. Come on. Oh, good drop, too. Let's go. We wasn't seeing that a lot last year. Is that short? Probably not. They're gonna say not short. That should be a breakup. It's like nobody wants to get in. Thank you. Like, how is he about to catch it on two people, man? They see something they like. Fuck, I gotta control the line. So, first down, I think. Oh, does he not? I don't know why I thought that.
Thank you. My corners are locking shit up. No lucky jump balls. We be having like two in the area at all times. Come on. Why is that not a catch? What's the penalty? Oh, I'm like, what? I know they didn't call that shit on me. Thank you, Dunn, because I'm in there and I'm spamming A. You can hear me button mashing. Oh my god. Bro. I don't know how that was open, but whatever. Well, it's game over. Yep. Why did they call timeout? I don't think this is an ice, but um, it's game over. Oh, it actually is. Right down the middle, uh, we played our fucking hearts out. Um, too many fucking turnovers, I can say that. Just too many turnovers. Uh, I feel like they changed my playbook. I'm not going to say they did, but that's how I feel. Um, yeah, it was bad. Could have played better, but I think uh, uh, just the intos, bro. Three intos in one game, just not ideal. I mean, their quarterback played okay. That fourth quarter when they were driving down the field to get the uh, tying touchdown, it was bullshit. That should never have been caught. Never. In a million years, it should never be caught. Like, he's there. Rushing, we did not have a good rushing game. It was bad. It just was not good. Then again, this D-line was amazing. So, what can we really say about that? Receiving... Pat Gardner had five catches for 115 yards. Gibbs had four catches for 37. Franklin had two catches for 36. And uh, the rest were just hairs and theirs. Defensively, uh, he did have, well, Belton had a crazy game with three sacks, two intercepts, two, three tackles for loss, two sacks. No interceptions. There's a couple other people with tackles for loss, like uh, Avery, who was my cornerback, who was having tackles for loss. He just had a half a sack in there. Um, yeah, Avery was kind of everywhere today, bro. Other people with sack, uh, Carpenter, no, Carrington. Don't know who Carrington is, though. And the only intro was Joe Wallace with uh, that beginning pick. I think our defense plays well, but... Um, we just got to play better overall, man. We have to play better. He is very dominant right now. We did not get the key to victory because we did not hold him under 200 passing yards. He had about like 270, 290, something like that. Just didn't work out for us this week. But, I mean, I like the way we played, man. Even though it ended in a loss, I still like the way we played. When we went to week two where we facing the Eagles, and I believe the breakout for Belton will continue. Yep, still can't stand out. We're going to set this to whatever. Um, yeah. End up losing that Vikings win, Bears win. We lose and Packers lose. So uh, we're going to be looking to pick up a win next week. Let's check where our offensive ranks are. We are 19th. 
somewhere in the middle. And for week one, we already a, what, top nine, top eight defense. So, yeah, just in week one, we're really back where we left off. We ended the season last year, like, with the second-ranked defense in the league. And, I mean, we're kind of just trying to pick up off that. So, yeah, if you did enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like. Uh, it really helps out the video. It really helps out the video a ton, actually. It helps out the video more than anything, obviously, other than you watching it. Uh, subscribe so you never... Subscribe and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video. And you get notified when I'm posting a video. Watching two videos on the screen, random video. I always say random video. It's not a random video. Let me try it again. <laughs> start. <laughs> start. Watch these two videos on the screen. It's going to be a previous episode, probably the last episode. Or end. I will say or and a playlist to this series. Yeah, that's gonna do it for me. Peace.